President Biden sparking controversy, calling Japan xenophobic alongside China and Russia. It happened at a campaign fundraiser marking Asian American, Native Hawaiian and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. Biden, citing concerns over China's economic slowdown and Japan's struggles, said, because they're xenophobic, they don't want immigrants. Immigrants are what makes us strong. Biden credited the United States' economic strength to immigrants, using these countries as a contrast. It's strong criticism from Senator Marco Rubio, who wrote on Twitter, Biden included an important ally, Japan, along with China and Russia, as a xenophobic country. That is why his staff doesn't want him speaking without note cards. Japan is one of the U.S.'s closest allies, but it has rattled some in the country's government. Several Japanese lawmakers criticized Biden's comments, too. One lawmaker saying, There aren't any countries that have solved this migration problem as of now, adding, I hope that President Biden will solve the problem in New York before he says things like this. Japan is making efforts to tackle its economic challenges, including falling fertility rates and labor shortages. The country aims to attract more foreign workers, but faces hurdles due to strict immigration laws. Recent legislation seeks to double the cap on skilled foreign workers and replace an internship program. Public attitudes in Japan are evolving, with recent surveys showing growing support for more foreign workers. Japan's economy, once the world's second largest, recently slipped to fourth as the country fights back from a weak yen and labor shortages. For more stories like this one, download the Straight Arrow News app or visit san.com.